Hi, my curious friends. Do you know what this is? I'll give you a hint. It is not a star. It's Venus, the planet closest to our own. Apparently, it is similar to Earth in many ways. When I found out about this, I didn't hesitate one bit. I knew I simply had to visit Venus. If Venus is similar to planet Earth, surely there will be Earthlings living on it. I mean, the Nusians. Ever since he was a robot kid, kid would dream of space, that's all he did. While he put together rocket ships, he would dream of interstellar trips. Oh. <laughs> now Robot Kid flies into space. He wants to know how life is different in this place. Kid loves to learn, he just can't stop. If he gets crushed by gravity, he'll fix himself right up. Cosmics! Venus. Yeah. Venus is the second planet from the Sun, just after Mercury. It's almost as big as Earth. And it is so close to Earth that we can see it in our sky, sometimes even in broad daylight. I must say, I expected a lot from making my acquaintance with Venus. I was looking forward to meeting the neighbors. The clouds are so thick, I can't see what's below me at all. I wonder what it looks like down there. Although conditions for landing were far from ideal, it was nothing an experienced traveler like myself wouldn't be able to handle. So I jumped in head first and was looking forward to meeting the Nusians. On the way down, I couldn't help noticing how hot it was. In conditions like these, an Earthling would not last a minute. I thought to myself that Venusians must be pretty hardy folk. <laughs> Luckily, I am no softy myself. <laughs> Ow! I'd imagined it different. Wasn't Venus supposed to be similar to Earth? Oh, never mind. Maybe Venusians just live differently than we do. Oh! Uh, uh. Huh? Apparently, a long time ago, there used to be water on Venus. But then the planet was wrapped in a blanket of gas so dense that Venus began heating up quickly and all water evaporated. This is called the greenhouse effect. Nothing will grow in this greenhouse ever again, I suppose. If there are any Venusians here, they're definitely not on the surface. Knock, knock, knock. Anyone home? I've come to meet you! Oh. Oh. Ah! oh dear me, it doesn't look like someone would live there. Time for liftoff! sad old Venus. It used to be so very much like our planet, but now it's completely covered by greenhouse gases, which turned it into an inhospitable pile of rock suffocating under heavy clouds. No wonder nobody lives there and nothing grows there. When I look around at planet Earth, covered with smoking cars and chimneys, I just hope it will not end up like this too one day. Uh...